was six years old, my first dream was to become archaeologist. Not a musician, but archaeologist. But probably now uh, I combine my musician's uh, skills with uh, my dream of being archaeologist because I spent a lot of time in archives and libraries with a big, big pleasure. And this place is one of the, one of the most beautiful I, I, I know. That when you work with a school of another conductor, he always goes to his kitchen. He always goes to his kitchen. Not every conductor likes to give his course to, to the students or to other people. Most of the conductors, they, they say, when, I'm, when I pass away, when I, when I am not anymore alive, my scores could be done. Could be, you can take them to the library and students can, can take them if they like them and learn and study them. But at the time when, when the conductor was still, is still working, conducting, recording, these small secrets they try to keep for themselves. They don't like to sh just to tell everybody, ah, oh, you know, I'm doing here this and this, and that's why it sounds so beautiful. No, you have to, if you, if you found something, uh, it's yours. <laughs> Kitchen is not for everyone. Yeah, the result of the, of the cooking, it's, it's great. But how exactly it has been done and how much, butter and how much eggs and how much uh, salt and pepper you, you used, who cares. The most important that at the very end everybody says wow.